Hey guys, Adam Fennig here with Fennig Equipment. You're tuned in to the Talking Shed. Today I'm out here on the equipment lot getting some pictures posted up online and the guys just pulled out this 40 foot five section two piece S tine cultivator and I wanted to shoot a video to not only show you guys the differences between the Salford and some competitors, but show you the features of this 40 foot uh, cultivator. So I'm gonna turn this around and let's dive in. So we're gonna start off at the front. The 40 foot five piece comes standard from the factory with a penal hitch. Um, so you're gonna need a clevis on your toolbar. Uh, of course, they use the heavy duty jack system. A lot of this thing is actually a little bit tongue heavy because of the double basket. So there's not much weight on this front jack. Um, it does take two hydraulic remotes to run it if you don't have a rear hitch. The red ones are gonna be for your raising lower and the green for the wings. Of course, we do have a nice light kit. But I wanna talk about this two-piece S-Tine. If we get down here and look at the difference between the frame height and the shovel, that distance there has been lengthened by that two-piece S-Tine. So that two-piece S-Tine does a lot of different things. Number one, it allows for maximum trash and residue clearance. A lot of guys have nice field cultivators, but if they're wanting to minimize passes, that means they're gonna throw their cultivator at some uh, instances where there's a lot of residue. And, and the question is, and the struggle, is will my cultivator get through that residue? And a lot of times it won't. So the goal here is that this distance here on the two-piece S-Tine is enough clearance to get all that trash and residue to flow through there. So this cultivator can, can be ran at a lot higher speeds than the competition for many reasons. The two-piece S-Tine strengthens this entire system. Because it's two-piece, you don't break parts nearly as often. And then we also have got this long life uh, cast shovel. This is a four and a half inch shovel on this 550. And this unit, like I said, is cast. It's a two bolt and man, these things can cover a lot of acres. So uh, gone are the days of changing shovels, you know, every few hundred acres. Uh, a lot of guys bought knock-on sweeps uh, because they were wearing out so fast, you had to change them all the time. Well, that's not the case with these Salfords. It's a two-bolt cast shovel that's going to get you acres and acres of, uh, of tillage. So we've got walking tandems everywhere. Of course, uh, on the mainframe, we've got 12L-15 tires on uh, walking tandems and on the wings there's tandems as well but a big part of this 550 that i really like is the finishing system we get back here and we've got the two rows of coil tine harrows and these harrows job is one thing and that is leveling uh, you can increase and decrease tension right here on these tines you pull that pin and pull that back and that will increase the tension on the tines and that will make them more aggressive which will make things more level then from there of course we get into the the double rolling basket system uh, what I like about that is when you increase pressure on those they do a phenomenal job of sizing the clods and the soil and everything that you're bringing up with those front shovels so a lot of guys can get by without having to pull a, a, a double rolling basket when you've got a setup like Salford offers here. Again, there is some tongue or some weight back here uh, from the double baskets and harrows, so there is a jack uh, back here in the back that you can play with. But that's pretty much the overview of the Salford 40 foot 550 uh, cultivator. It's a beast of a unit. And the coolest thing about it is, there's no waiting in line to get one. This one's assembled, field ready, and ready to drop a hitch pin in it here at Coldwater, Ohio, here in July of 22. That's pretty hard to come by. So we order often and we order early to make sure that our customers have got equipment available to push their operation forward. So that's what we're doing today, checking out a Salford 550 cultivator Give us a call to talk more, and thanks for tuning in.